Okay, here we go once again. <laughs> and good Monday to all y'all out there in YouTube land. We are brought to you by the uh, home finger of Dakota Wesleyan. This is the Jerry Hinkle program, by the way. Uh, coming to you almost live, just about pretty near from uh, the Ashley Kringen studio of the uh, UBS network. We're also brought to you by our semi-regular sponsor, Tang, instant uh, breakfast uh, drink, 100 days supply of uh, vitamin C in every glass, depending on the size of the glass, it could be more. And uh, so, what else? Uh, I guess, I, oh, you know what, I don't want to talk about Trump. Uh, well, forget about that. What we are going to talk about, though, is a few things closer to home. Uh, remember when I was so excited last uh, Monday about the Christmas tree going up? In Horn Pallet Square. Well, it turns out that there uh, wasn't no, there was no Christmas at the Corn Palace, or parade of lights, or anything like that. All that's going to happen on the fifth of December, next Monday. So we'll see how that goes. Maybe uh, we'll uh, do something uh, about that. And we might, you know, if I, if if the mood strikes me and we find us. Uh, someone famous enough that would consent to be on the show, maybe we'll do something from the Corn Palace. You never know. Anyhow, what else do we have going on? Oh, last week we also talked about Kristen Noem, our representative in Washington, and she's going to be running for governor, as, as we uh, discussed last week. And... Um, also, Marty Jackley, the Attorney General of South Dakota, is going to be running for governor. It, it's, uh, it looks like now. So that's going to be, and they're blaming the ethics law that uh, initiated Measure 22, if I'm if I'm remembering my laws correctly. It was, you know, they voted that in, and I guess that sucker took effect uh, the minute people voted yes. Because everybody and his dog decided to run for some kind of office. A couple of, well, not everybody, just those two. And uh, just interestingly enough, our old friend Dusty Johnson from the Public Utilities Commission and uh, Governor Ducart's former chief of staff, he gave up all, all the action in Pierre for a chance to live as a private citizen and well now he's running for congress so we'll see how that goes uh i don't want to wish him any bad luck it's just that oh if he goes and he he does actually get elected i'm worried he'll go to washington become a politician you'll never ever see him again and you know this state could use all the uh, brilliant young men's that it, it can get <laughs> and you know for to provide leadership and whatnot so, um, but, you know, we'll leave it all up to God's hands and see what he's got in store. And I guess that's really all we got to talk about. So, uh, so long from the Ashley Kringen Studios here in the uh, UBS Network. And uh, we're brought to you by uh, Foam Finger and, of course, Tang. Uh, God be with you. Do the best you can. And, uh, hey, get out of my vacuum. You're invading my privacy.